Hey, we're out here at Birdie's Golf Center with Teresa. Teresa, what brings you out tonight? Well, I heard they had tips from the pros on Friday nights, so I thought I'd come hit some balls and see what they had to say. Excellent. We got Marla here. Marla's the LPGA professional here at Birdie's. Uh, Marla, what do you got for Teresa? Hi. <laughs> well, I'm going to watch you hit a couple balls, and what seems to be your problem? I've been hitting the ground way before the ball a lot, so oh, I'd like okay. to get some help with that. Okay. Marla, is that a is that a common thing you see among a lot of golfers? It is. Okay. It's, it's very common. Yeah. Good. Let's see if we can work this out. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, go ahead. All right. Let's watch you hit a ball or two, and then uh, we'll go from there. Okay. Okay. All right, one more for me. Okay. So, very nice. Um, I definitely see why you are hitting behind the ball. And it's actually something very simple. Um, I have a perfect drill that we can do. And here's what's going on. When you hit behind the ball, basically your club is bottoming out like two or three inches behind, right? It feels real heavy. So what's happening is your lower body is not getting through fast enough. So I want you to feel like when you do these next few practice swings that you're really getting left or getting through it. So what this board is gonna do is I'm going to put the ball right here. Right. When you hit, try not to hit the board. And if your club actually hits it, it's okay. It's just plexiglass. It won't hurt you, it won't hit the club. So maybe do a couple practice swings first just to get used to this being there. And you're going to feel a sensation of getting all the way to your front foot a lot faster. All right. Okay, go ahead and try So when you do that again, you go ahead and trade me. Now I'll show you. That was good. Also feel like once you turn back and you're coming through now, right through impact, really feel yourself speed up too. Don't be afraid to, you know, that the tempo is not going to be right or out of rhythm. It's okay. You actually want to speed up coming through. This will also help you shift your weight to your front leg as well. So when you're doing this, really feel yourself shifting to your left leg. And that'll help you hit more right on top of the ball and your divot will actually be after the ball, not the ball. <laughs> awesome, okay. All right, one more practice swing, then we'll give this a try. There you go, awesome, all right. It's a little less okay. <laughs> it's probably going to because I haven't really played much. Alright, let's go ahead and take the board out and go ahead and hit one now. Awesome. Good. And even though you fell over, that's okay because now you know you're actually shifting your way to your front leg. Good. Alright. Thank you. You're that welcome. Much more solid than good. Than before. Awesome. That's what we want. Solid golf shots. <laughs> We're back here with Marla. Marla, tell us more about tips from the pros. Yeah, thanks. We had a great turnout tonight. Whether you're a single handicapper or a beginner, you are welcome to come out on Friday nights from five to close. And the instructors here will come out, give you a free tip, and hopefully help you with your golf game. And we also offer a dollar, dollar beers on Friday nights as well.
Better golf starts with birdies. <laughs>